take a look at Mobius Model 1.8 scale classic Batman. I'll start with the box. Uh, I actually like it. It's uh, very nicely done. Uh, the uh, artist that did the uh, box art for this and the upcoming uh, series of Batman kits is a Christopher Frenchy. I apologize if I do get the name uh, pronounced wrong, but uh, you can find him by Googling and he does have a Facebook page and you can scope out his other artwork. Uh, box art is gorgeous. The uh, back has the uh, built up by David Fisher. The uh, next one uh, kit coming out in the series will be Julie Newmar. And once you get all the uh, uh, other uh, figures, you can create a uh, base, which I'll show you in the instructions. But there you have it. Excellent box. Uh, the instructions. Uh, the instructions are actually multi-pages. Uh, there's page one. Page two. Now, uh, I'll say right now, the uh, instructions are very clear. They are self-explanatory. Also, this kit's made for the modeler in mind. As you can see, the uh, head right here, which is, you can, uh, once you get the head assembled, you can uh, paint the face with ease and then be able to put the uh, cowl mask on and uh, just easier to do. But anyway, page two, you can see all the uh, uh, parts layouts are self-explanatory. Page four. Page five. Page six. And as you can see here, uh, the series of kits, you get the, the Penguin, the Riddler, Robin, Batgirl, Joker, Catwoman, and Batman's base uh, is this part. And the completed model and paint guide what to use on page seven and page eight. Uh, the kit itself comes in a basically like a blue gray styrene. Uh, I'll start with the cape. Uh, there's a little bit of a line right right here, which uh, just a little sandpaper will knock that off or a back of a knife. Uh, the base, which is the uh, I call it a puzzle base, but there's that. The arms, I don't really see any flash or anything of that nature. Uh, I haven't put one together, so I do not know how it fits. To me, it looks like it'll fit really well. I have seen people do uh, test shots of it, uh, and very minimal uh, modeling work needs to be done. Uh, The legs, the bent legs, the uh, torso. Part of the head and the battering, you get a uh, display base, excuse me, a plaque, if you will. And the Adam West head. Very nice kit, very nice. Also, you do get bat rope uh, you get two kinds of uh, markings basically you get decals actual water slide decals and you do get stickers and uh, really nicely done I thought that was photo at first but that's actually a sticker as you can see but uh, either way if you want to put decal or uh, put the sticker on I think you uh, do well and putting stickers on on a model with a uh, future or clear coat will uh, actually do it so uh, that's really about it 
Uh, really great looking kit. The uh, another uh, win for Mobius here, and I'm looking forward to the uh, series and uh, have the whole set. Uh, really great kit. I got this uh, from the Colt TV man. Uh, you'd be able to get it online or any other uh, fine uh, retail uh, stores, hobby shops uh, of that nature. And I also know that the uh, uh, aftermarket people will be doing some uh, accessories for that. Uh, I know uh, like for new base, uh, ODG and other people will be uh, doing some aftermarket parts for them. So really uh great kit and be a lot of batman builds i uh, highly recommend the uh mobius 1-8 batman kit